Okay, so we're going two more east here. If I can get around this damn island. To Bird Rock Peak. Let's get the right sail, Scales. Come on. Okay. Okay, so Bird Rock's Peak, we are going to need arrows because I believe, if I remember correctly now, we have to kill the birds that are flying around. And then we need to use the pair to hit stuff. I kind of remember this one. So that is going to make it a little tough. But we have two pairs. Yeah, we have two. So I have a chance. And the good thing is you have to kill all the birds first, I think. So that's good because uh, the birds, if they hit you when you're the seagull, seagull-like stops. So that is frustrating. And we've got two of them, and they should all be dead. And once we kill them, this door should open. So let's start with this guy. Yeah, how do you like that? Oh, fuck. Is he gonna move? No. Oh, come on. Too low. Oh yeah, get the one that's flying around. Tough shot. Oh, come on. Oh, this is getting frustrating. Let's get higher up. Maybe that's it. Maybe we need to get higher up. Make it an easier shot. If we hook that, I should be able to actually. No, Scowls, you dumbass. I hook that, I should be able to climb up it and then hop up to that top ledge. Alright, so this may make it a easier shot for me at least. That is, that's much easier. Okay, so now I believe they're all gone. So let's try this, this pair. I hope I don't screw this up. I only got two of them. So we gotta hit all the switches. Yeah, good, good job on the first one there. Nice work. Oh my god. Okay, I can't hit any of the switches. Ugh. I don't want to like hit it and then like run into something. Oh my gosh. Oh, I did get that one. It looks like I got that one even though I didn't make a noise. I first figured I'd make a noise or something. Well, the one I did get, even though I didn't make the noise. I 
Okay, I didn't know if you hit it like the wrong way or you run into the mountain if it actually kills the seagull. So I was trying to be extra careful with it. Now it looks like it, it does not happen. So, okay, so we can try to go at it better. I was trying to be too careful when I was missing them. Okay, where's this mountain peak? Did I go way too far up? There it is. Oh no, we got that one. Oh, where's the one that's crazy high? There it is, okay. And there's one more lower. Did I not get that? Okay, so where's the low one? It's the only one left. Figures. Oh my god. Okay, let's get even with it. Oh my god, how could that not have it? Thank you. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, don't run off the edge. little freaking islands man one of these better give me arrows nope money and Magic. Okay, so we should have three charts, two Triforce pieces. There's one in the very northeast of the whole world. The quickest way there is probably to warp to the forest, the dragon roost, yeah, and then go northeast. Then we gotta find the ghost ship chart, and then find the ghost ship itself. And then we gotta do the windfall 50 dungeon. It's a 50 floor dungeon, basically. You fight, then the door, then you fight, then uh, you kill everybody in the area. In the first floor, say, and then you fall down a hole, a hole opens up, then you kill everybody in the next one, and you gotta do that. And I believe, in actuality, the uh, treasure chart's only on floor 30, but the actual, if you get to 50, you get the last piece of heart, so we gotta do all of it. Because I need to get that last piece of heart, I can't not do that. I got every one but one right now. So we're going, I believe this is Diamond Step Isle. Or no. No, this is Overlook Isle? Got the name wrong. We gotta, okay. We got to hook shot with this. I do know that. Got the name of the place wrong. So we could hook shot from our boat. Oh, snow scales. We gotta be closer than that, apparently. Okay, let's get a little closer. Okay, it's not letting us do it. How close do I gotta get? That's the lowest point, isn't it? I'm gonna get hit. Okay, is that not the lowest point? 
Maybe we gotta go on land. Okay, let's go on land then. Looks like we can go on land first. Let's do that. Okay. There we go. That was weird. I think just got really goofy on me. It's not going high enough. Okay, there we go. Why didn't you go in high enough? Is it because that tree's behind me? Yeah, it must be. It's like hit the camera hit like a wall and wouldn't actually allow me to go up higher. I don't even know that dude is there. I'm trying to find some arrows. I don't think they're gonna give me arrows here. Yeah, because the trees behind me, the camera wouldn't actually go any farther up. So I was kind of stuck there. There's the hole. What's up higher? Pots. Some magic and money. This is not going to be just a walk in the park, I take it. Of course not. Another one of these. Orange is the one that gives you your items. More than anything, I believe. Even though it seems like they kind of all do. Now, since you don't get hearts anymore from the red ones, then I think they all kind of give items. Oh, they're messing around with this, are they? Skull. Come here. Bring me your skull. Oh, you bitch. I don't need this kind of time either. Oh, you bitch. that we have no fairies. So I gotta be careful here. Shit. Oh, my God. 
sky. Alright, it's gonna be stupid to keep going without just drinking some of this stuff. It fills me all the way up. And I got two helpings. If I die here, I'm gonna be very pissed. Because it's actually been a while. I haven't saved since I started this. Which reminds me. <laughs> Real quick, I'm gonna save. Just in case something really bad happens. I don't wanna do all this again if I don't have to. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. I guess you're too fast to charge up that move, huh? Who's out here this time? Four of them. Two silvers and a gold. It's gonna be tough. that you can't hit them when they're laying on the ground. I think you should be able to. You gotta wait till they stand up. They're immune to them when they're lying on the ground. Oh, come on. Seriously, my Wii stick, I seriously pulled that over. It's been kind of acting up a little bit. The right stick doesn't pull over all... It doesn't always follow. It's like I move it and it's staying in the one spot it was before. find the ghost ship. That's what we need to do. And I believe the ghost ship is Diamond Step Isle, actually. We need to find where that's at. We need to not get bombed first. Where's our ship? There we are. Alright, I'm gonna pause and try to find Diamond Step Isle. I'm pretty sure that's where it's at, if I remember. So that's uh, all the way in the. Well, we gotta go to Outlook. Northwest of Outlook. I just did that backwards. Or oh, outside, not Outlook. Okay, 
so I believe it's in Diamond Step. Yeah, it is, because I've actually looked at the fish. I forgot they had them on the maps. Wait. If you use the treasure hidden on the island, the thing that vanishes as soon as you get near it, it won't vanish anymore. Um, because when you throw the bait down and the fish give you hints, in this version on the gamepad, you can actually click each each part of the each map or each square, and then click the fish, and it'll tell you what the hint was. And the hint that he gives is that in this place you get the thing that allows you to go onto the ghost ship. So not only does it show you where the ghost ship is at certain moons, but then it actually allows you to board it. Because we've seen it a few times, but we haven't been able to. Oh, what is this? Where did this guy come from? Oh my god, are you kidding me? I wasn't even paying attention. There's freaking seagulls out here. Nothing can be easy, can it? God, this thing's taking forever. There's only one left. Alright. I, no, I didn't know I did this guy was here. He doesn't get, have a crazy item. He probably has money. I would assume, because we've gotten most of the... We've gotten every item I believe we need to get. So let's see what he's got. He's probably got some decent cash. I'm gonna assume. rupees. It's a good amount of cash. And we're going the wrong way. We're going that way. So this one I think we have to come off the boat with the hook shot. The other one we can walk on the land. I don't think there's, yeah, this is the one I was thinking of. There's not a way to actually get on land here without using the hook shot. First, yeah. Okay, I was trying to do it on that other island. I knew there was one of them like that, at least. So this is the same principle as the other one. Just hook shot up as much as you can. Eventually we should find a hole to go into. There it is. these places. Oh, with the pots. So we gotta use the pots, okay. That's the way we gotta go, I believe. Cause he's there.
Yeah, I think we gotta head down here. There's two of them down here. Yep. I think it's this one. I'm trying to remember. That is the, I think it's the right path. Alright, so the first one. One around the wall. The one that you fall down, the first one under you. Really, only be the only one left, which is that one. Let's actually burn it so I don't spend time with that dude trying to kill me. Okay, yeah, this is the right one. All right, nice. Okay, so we have the ghost ship chart, and this should take us right back, right? No? Yes? Yes, okay. So it is night. So let's take a look at the ghost ship chart. Where are you at? There it is. What the, what's the moon right now? Okay, it's that half moon. So the ship is to the west. According to this chart, the ship's to the west of the world. It looks like it's actually lit up. The western part of... The whole western part of the sea. It's broken up into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... Like 7 quadrants, almost triangles. So I guess it doesn't give you the exact location, but it gives you the area. So with that information... We want to head to Great Fish Isle. should be somewhere in this vicinity. <laughs> Actually, I can click each of the... Let's see if we see it first. You gotta make it night again. Make it night. Let's see what the moon. Let's see what the ghost. What the um. Oh, it's right there. Are you kidding me? That was easy enough. Oh, that looks like Great Fish Isle. I guess it doesn't exactly have. No, I was wrong. I guess it's not a quadrant. It just shows you what the isle looks like. Yeah, that's kind of what Great Fish Isle looks like from above. Okay, I had it wrong. So we sail into it, nice. And now we're in here, okay. And we gotta kill these dudes. Uh, 
Oh, okay. Dude, I'm hitting you with the fucking thing. I thought actually that was a little bit tougher than that. All the money we can use. out all right so we got the shard nice so we have everything we need except the one on outset island which is the one that takes forever we have to get to the 30th floor of this island of the uh, the thing here and that's where we get it and then if we get to the 50th we should get the heart piece Actually, I didn't want to warp here yet. I'm going to stop the vid here, though. I'm going to warp to Mother and Child and fill up on fairies, is what I'm actually going to do. And then we're going to head back here. Okay, so thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you all in the next one, where we try to take out this 50-floor mini dungeon. So.